We made this video probably two years ago and never really saw the light of day. It just didn't really belong on the main channel and I kind of forgot about it, but I was going through it. I did some new edits on it to make it flow better. The goal of this video is to kind of make a parody of how like ghost hunting shows are, uh, but there was actually some unexplained stuff in this video, but I hope you guys enjoy it and have a happy Halloween. All right, so it is really dark right now and we're gonna do something special on this video. I planned on doing this several weeks ago, but it did not work out. This is the Halloween themed video I wanted to do, but we are gonna try to go paranormal hunting with uh, me, Wyatt's on the camera, and then my mom's here. We're at my uh, grandparents' property and we're at a really old, old property, so we're just gonna walk around and try to find ghosts. We'll get to it, we're gonna start. It's hard to tell because there's no light, but and we don't have night vision, so we're, we're doing this with flashlights. But we're just gonna go into the old barn, walk around the property. All right, so here is the old barn. It was built back in the early 1900s, right? Or was it late maybe 1800s? Late, maybe late 1800s. Not really sure. It was. But it it's an old barn. Because Art was born here, and he... I think it was late 1800s that yeah. it was homesteaded. Hmm. So it's old. This everything's original on this. Um, is still got some of the original equipment that was used back in the day in here. Some of his old tools that he had when he was here. Um, many people have stated that they have seen art hanging around. So we'll see if he comes and sees us tonight. So the person that originally owned this property um, or built it, his name was Art or Arthur, but. We called him Art. He's been known to haunt this place. I shouldn't say haunt. I think he's been friendly, but he's been known to be still be around anyways. So this is where uh, they fed the cows back in the day. Just the headlocks, they would dump the feed right there. And this is where the cows were. They milked the cows, this is where the cows laid. And they milked them right here. True woodman's craft, mm -hmm. woodcraft right there. Yep, yeah, this. All the mortars and tendons. Yeah. Yeah. Back before power tools were a thing. Yep, yeah. they use wooden nails too. Milwaukee don't have shit on that. <laughs> so this is the, the house, original house. It's been renovated to modern days, but that house is very old. So this is where the hay was stored. Right now it is full of just stuff. This is our camper. We're storing it here for the winter. Um, but, you know, it's just storage right now. But this is where they would store the hay. Basically all the top floor was. Oh, that's creepy. <laughs> oh, it's just this monkey mask or something back here. It's like, it's pretty spooky looking. Evil monkey. <laughs> Should throw that to mom. <laughs> so we used to rent this property out to people and they would store just garbage in here and it's still in here. That's why there's just so much crap laying around right now. Hey, there's a hole. Are them all hay holes? Like throw hay and shit down? Yeah. Yep, they would throw the hay whatever, straw, hay, whatever, mainly straw for bedding down this hole. Old toolbox. Oh, that is some sweet old wrenches in there. Yeah. Look at that. I think this is cool. That is pretty neat. That's some old stuff. Like an old pipe wrench or something. Yeah. It's got teeth on it. Yeah. I would say that's like a pipe wrench. All right. Uh, something you put in the middle. Maybe a multi-tool of some sort. Hmm. Patent. Patent pending still. <laughs> I wonder if it's been. I don't know. I wonder That's if the cool. patent went. What? There's something in the basement. Did you? I heard it. I thought maybe that was you that stepped over there, but. Oh no, it was like a chain. Oh. Well, it might have been us. This? That was not it. Really? That's cool. Alright, Mom, you're going down. <laughs> You play with the Ouija board before you came out? Never. Not, that yeah. is something I never will do, and I do not, never have allowed my children to do. My mom and her sisters used to play with one, and some weird happened, so they put it away. <laughs> yeah. 
Alright. She said she'll never touch the thing. Someone's gonna start talking to the ghost. Well, I I heard I heard something down there. Like a chain clank? Yes, I did. See that rope down there? It was swinging. <laughs> it is swinging. Oh. I mean, it might be wind, but... It's not really that breezy, though. Yeah, there's pretty cold here. Okay, there's a breeze. Decent draft. There's, there's a draft in here. So there is a draft coming through this window. Like, look at that. It's so, yeah, you can see that there's a, a there's weed. a weed right there. It's hard to see, but it is blowing in. So there is a draft in here. So that, that is probably debunked. Need to smoke any pot? Nope. There's some pots right there you can smoke. Pots? <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah, there's some pots. So we're not really hearing anything yet, but if he was talking to us on the microphone, we might be able to hear it when I'm on the computer. We'll have to find out later. But we're gonna go and walk around some more of the property, kind of give you a tour, and then uh, we'll probably do some more investigation and then split up. I know mom is ecstatic for that. Just out here, go seeking tonight with the Brachaholics, hoping to find something, maybe see something, maybe hear some stuff. Just checking out grandpa's farm property known to have some ghosts living around here and this is a little shed we're helping redo it uh, we just put steel on it but this shed it's pretty old um, it was built after everything else was built it was kind of it was kind of arts workshop that's what it was so right now it's just got a quad and stuff it's old you see the roof you can see the old roof was falling in. We just put new steel over it. But art made would would do woodworking in here. There's cars passing by. Oh, I had this on the dim setting. So this is just a, basically this was just a storage shed for equipment, wasn't it? Essentially? I think so. They put horses in here? I don't know. We'd have to ask for that Yeah. Question. Not really sure what the main purpose of this was, but right now. It's old hay. It's, it's, it's an open barn. Hay. I'm Either they park they equipment. They probably kept the horses here. Yeah. It's probably the horses and probably equipment, but I'm guessing it was horses. On tonight. No, Art, did you guys keep horses in here? Too much car noises. <laughs> yeah. Someone's here, knock twice. Oh, yeah, I was gonna say, was that you? Thank <laughs> <laughs> you. You turned. Oh, the hole there. <laughs> yeah, Wyatt's here. So we are gonna go split off and see if we can get any more luck um, doing it by ourselves. You never know. Maybe the ghost is shy and wants to be one on one. <clears throat> so I uh, we guess we'll get a game plan. Um, we're gonna have mom go in the barn. I guess I'm going in the barn. <laughs> He's not very nice we'll to me. Someone, I guess, could go in that shed over there. The shed? Yeah. I'll try, check it out. You could try the garage. Oh, and someone could go in the garage. And then someone could stay here, too. We can all mingle, but Mom, you go in the... You, you start I'll off check with... Check out the shed. You start off with the barn. You're, you're not nice. Because you seem to be hearing the most noises. I can go poke the bear, and then you can go after me if you <laughs> I'll go poke the bear. And uh, I'll start off in the garage and then maybe mingle out in the property somewhere else. Alright, so we're back in the barn. I'm back in the barn. 
by myself. It's a tight squeeze through here. <sighs> See that string? It's not moving anymore. Oh, there it goes. Okay. So, Art, um, is this like your uh, tool shed? At this point, this is where a lot of the activity is going to happen. Listen closely. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. No one heard this with their own ears. And originally we thought it was a dog, but there's no dogs in this area. There's no dogs in this property. We didn't hear any dogs barking at all the whole night. It was dead silent the whole night. It sounds like something is saying art. I am not sure. You guys decide. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. You're probably hear Wyatt in the background. All right, Art, or if anybody else is here, if you want to talk to me, we can be one on one. If you're, if someone's here, could they please make a sound? I'm not having much luck in the garage, so I'm gonna go walk around back to the shed. Maybe around the property a little bit. All right, Art, are you in here? Are you just staying back and laughing at us because you think this is funny? <laughs> I can see you doing that. I think Jesse was chicken to do this by himself the first time in the barn. Hear that, Jesse? Chicken. Nope. nope. No progress. Okay, we're back. It's quiet. You like the peace and quiet? We're not bugging you, are we? We're maybe trying a little, but... It's just fun just to see if you're here and how you doing. This is a pretty good example showing how dust behaves in this area. The dust is weightless, it floats there, and it floats up. You're about to hear something that we cannot explain. Listen closely. What do you think it sounds like? I sure do love your old farm you got here, Art. Very well built. Well, I'm gonna go and meet up with Wyatt, or Wyatt or Mom, and we'll probably uh, swap spots. See if we can find anything else. Ah, I might have heard a whistle and wind through there, but it might have been just the wind. I don't know. <laughs> and then when you said something in the garage, yeah, I thought I heard like a footstep, but then it went away. When you oh. said something, so. You know, I thought I heard something over toward the garage. This way? Yeah, but maybe it was you. I didn't say anything on camera. Well, you said something, like you two were shouting back and forth about something. Oh, yeah. 
And I was in there, I was talking about the cow, like, look at that monster. And I thought I heard, like, a footstep over by the tools where I was just at. Oh, really? But then you shouted and said something, and then I didn't hear nothing. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. Got that big, mean Kawasaki there. I'm like, I just thought in my head. Hmm. Yeah, it could be. He, he did woodworking in there. Yeah. I was trying. I was like, well, did you store your horses in here or your tools? or? <laughs> oh, you uh, want to take a shot at the barn? Yeah. All right. You can have that. I'll yeah. do the garage. All right, we're switching spots. Mom's in the garage. I'm going to be in this little workshop, and Wyatt's going to take his chance in the barn. And hopefully we find something. We're in close prop proximity of each other so unfortunately I'm hoping that Mike doesn't capture the voices of everybody else um, we'll see all right so back here in the wood shop is there anybody in here Freaking cars. We're close to the road, so the cars are really echoing. It's hard to hear things. If someone's in there, can they make a knock? Can you make one of these tools move? There's wind blowing right now. That's leaves moving. If you also look, I also found something unknown flying by in the same area that we caught the orb when Wyatt was in here. Is it a bug, particle, something unknown? Can you close that door? Wyatt's in the barn right now. Can you go and scare Wyatt? I think Wyatt needs a good scaring. Looks like you like drinking lots of coffee. I suppose a lot of farmers like drinking coffee though. Looks like an old ice fishing shack. I don't know if you guys heard that, but there was a creek over there in that corner. Anybody up here? So we are on the top floor right now of the house. We all split up in separate rooms. Michelle's cam was the only camera that was actually seeing any of these particles that you're about to see. the cat. <laughs>
concert. We didn't really hear or see much at all, but uh, still got to go over the video and see if the camera's caught anything. And there's a car going by. We're going to have to go through the video and see if we can find anything. Maybe something that happened in, on the camera that we weren't able to see. Uh, it's also a little early. We really, probably really should be doing this like 1 to 3 a.m. That's usually when the spirits come out. <laughs> Damn brapaholics out there. Yeah. Anyways, we are going to the gravel pit for the last time uh, in the next video after this. So we'll, hopefully it's a fun time. Why it's going to be there and Dustin and, and uh, Hunter, Thomas, they'll all be there. Brock will be there. So last ride, it's just a beautiful weekend. So we're going to make it work and it's going to be awesome. So I hope you guys liked the video and I'll see you in the next one.